Welcome to Coastal Bend College's tutorial on how to navigate the library databases and research guides. Both the research guides and library databases are found on the library's homepage, lrc.coastalbend.edu. By scrolling to the center of the library's homepage, you can see our research guides portion. We have created various tools within these research guides to help you in your research process and coursework. These guides have been created for the most commonly researched disciplines. Now let's see what one of these research guides looks like. Many of these contain the same format, so once you're able to navigate one, you'll have no trouble with the others. Let's go into the Psychology Research Guide. From the Psychology Research Guide, the first tab, called Psychology Resource Overview, contains featured books, and a link to the other tabs that are listed here. The first tab, Find Books and Reference Sources, contains not only a link to our library catalog to find print books, but also ebook links. The next tab over, called Find Articles, lists the best databases for the psychology field. I'll go more into detail about this in a second. The following tab, Psychology Data Sources contains the best websites for statistical data. Other tabs, such as Writing and Research Tips and Library Database Tutorials, might help you if you want to learn a little extra. The APA Citation tab allows you to gain more knowledge into APA style, which is what is used for the field of psychology. Now whether or not APA or MLA is listed is based on the research guides discipline. But let's go back up to the Find Articles tab. From here, as I mentioned before, we have the best databases for the field of psychology. I'm going to go into a brief overview of how to navigate EBSCOhost. You can also get a full list of our library databases by going back to the library's homepage and clicking on Library Online Resources. Here we have a complete A to Z listing of our library databases along with a quick start guide of our most commonly used databases. Now I'd like to note, don't waste your time and money by searching Google and other search engines for scholarly articles. Your tuition and fees pay for access to these articles, so start here first. Let's go back to the psychology research guide and look at EBSCOhost. EBSCOhost is a multidisciplinary database that contains scholarly journals containing peer-reviewed articles for your research needs. Searching EBSCOhost, like many other library databases, involves a few more steps than searching the web. EBSCOhost, along with our other databases, will prompt you for a username and password so you can access these articles for free. Your username is your last name and the last four digits of your social security number, and your password will be your student ID number. You can also use the on-campus visitor access tab off the entire database list to avoid entering this if you are on campus. If you have any further questions, feel free to contact your campus librarian at their corresponding phone number or email address. The next video will be an example search to locate an academic article in EBSCOhost.